Hello everyone, in today's video we're gonna take a closer look at the 2024 models from Solidome. We have here a PDF uh, of all the models, all, almost all models that uh, Solidome released at the 118, 124 and 143 scale. Let's start. First of all we have some RW models, we have uh, some new colors uh, for the 964. We have uh, this black Dark Vader uh, model, and also we have here uh, this one, uh, which is a uh, RW Mattis Idols, I think. Uh, uh, also, we have the uh, new mold for the 993 models RWB. So we have this pink one, the Martina livery, and also the uh, blue one. Next, we have the Mazda X7 uh, FD, and we have it in yellow, green, uh, red, and uh, this uh, orange and uh, with uh, uh, black uh, hood. Also, these are new models as uh, new molds as well. And uh, if you can see, it will feature uh, uh, pop-up he headlights, just like the 850i BMW. Next, we have the Honda Civic, which is a new mold as well. We have it in uh, uh, white, um, yellow with uh, black uh, bonnet, and also red with black bonnet. Next, we have uh, new colors for the Supra. We have orange with uh, black bonnet, and also we have uh, uh, full black. We have uh, two new colors for the Nissan GTR Liberty Walk. We have the uh, this gray with the graphics and also we have the, the purple one next we have some uh, uh, Renault 5 GT Turbo phase 2 we have the blue we have the white and red next we have the Renault 12 um, which is a new color we have this uh, blue version also we have the Alpine uh, A110 uh, again, another uh, new color for this model, and also we have the Dacia Duster, which is uh, a new mold, uh, and we have it here in green. Next, we have the Renault 4 LGLT GTL uh, in green. Again, new color, new co color also for the Fuego Turbo, and also for the Renault 12 Turbo Phase One. We also have a new color for the Citroen Type HI uh, Citroen Service, this uh, uh, yellow one, which looks pretty good. Uh, we have a new color for the Alpine 18 with the uh, Gendarmerie from 2023. Next, we have the Shelby GT500 with uh, Burgundy Red. Uh, this model has uh, been released, actually. Um, uh, we'll have a video very soon. It's uh, already got uh, to us. Next, we have the Dodge Challenger RT Pack in a new color, this blue with uh, black uh, accents. Also, we have the new color for the GT500, this uh, gray with uh, green stripes. I think they made uh, the similar model at the 143 scale, if I'm, if I'm not uh, wrong. Next, we have new colors for the F1. GTR, uh, short tail, we have the white, we also have this uh, white with red uh, livery, and also we have the blue with uh, silver livery as well. We have a new color for the Porsche 956 LH, uh, with the Boss uh, um, livery. Again, some new colors for some rally cars. We have the uh, Peugeot 306 Maxi with the number one. Also, we have the Renault 5 Turbo and also Renault 5 Turbo Rally uh, Lyon. And we have another color for the Ford Puma uh, from the Rally uh, Sweden Rally 2023 with the number eight uh, Tanak. We have uh, Peugeot uh, 306 Maxi. In 2022, we have um, another Subaru Impreza STI um, from 1997, 
We have an Opel Omega Evo 500 DTM from 1991, and uh, also we have a Porsche 935 K3 um, from 1977. Um, next, we have uh, another Subaru Impreza 22B from uh, Monte Carlo Rally 99. Uh, La Daniva from Paris Dakar 1984. Again, these are also all new colors. Peugeot 2005 uh, Rally from 1990. And also we have the BMW M3 from uh, DTM, uh, the 1989 season. Next, we go to the Formula One cars. We have new modes for the 2023 uh, models. We have the Alpine F1 team uh, from Monaco GP. We have the uh, Esteban Ocon uh, model and also the Pierre Casli one. Next, we have new bolts for the Alfa Romeo team. We have uh, Bottas and uh, its teammate uh, Guan Yu um, from Canadian GP and uh, from Australia GP. And also we have it from uh, uh, Italian GP for Vettel Bottas. New models for the McLarens as well. We have the Great Britain from 2023, also from uh, London Norris and Os Oscar Piastri. Uh, and we have the Monaco GP from for uh, um, London Norris. Next we have new cars for Alpine uh, A110 from 1969. We have two colors. We have the red one and the one with the livery from Rally Monte Carlo. Also, we have the Aston Martin DB5. Again, another color. And also another color for the Porsche 356 uh, from 1953. We'll also have new colors for the Alfa Romeo Giulia. We'll have the uh, uh, this livery, which personally I don't like. I don't know why they did it, but... Uh, maybe there's a person there that uh, they like this uh, livery, this uh, yellow with black. Also, we have the uh, blue one. We have another color for the 600 LT. Um, next, we have some exciting news, new molds uh, uh, for, for the BMW 635 CSI. We have the Jagermeister livery and also we have the red one. Uh, I will. Uh, I expect. Uh, I would uh, like very much to see those uh, uh, live. Hope they release them uh, soon. New molds for uh, the Porsche 911 from uh, Daytona 1974, and also from uh, uh, Riverside, Riverside. Sorry, uh, with uh, this uh, bl uh, blue version. Next, we have uh, new colors. Um, for the M3 uh, E36 uh, BMW, we have the silver. Also, we have another uh, blue version. We have new color for a new color for the Golf uh, Volkswagen Golf. I think it's the Mark One version from 1983. Also, we have uh, another version for the uh, 964 911 from 1990. Uh, I think this is the Bad Boys. Uh, a car, the black one they released a while ago. A new color for the Beetle Baja, uh, Baja. not a very tasty model for me at least. A new color for the Volkswagen T1 uh, pickup uh, with the 53 livery. Uh, also a new color for the Porsche 911 RSR Tour de France uh, 1973. A new mold for uh, Alpina B7 Turbo E24 from 1984, another model that I am looking forward to it. New models for the KS, KSR, I don't know, this is a modified Porsche, very interesting uh, model, uh, again, to see. We have new molds for the uh, trucks, I think these are 124 scale models. We have the Mercedes Actors in different liveries. Also, we have the Volvo and uh, the Scania, which is a new color for the Scania and for the Volvo. 
And uh, at the 143 uh, scale, we have some uh, uh, Dodge De uh, Demon, which is a new color, a Renault Megane 2 RS, R 26R. Uh, in black, we have uh, some Renault uh, Austral new molds for this model. A new mold for the Audi Avant RS2. Uh, in, we have it in two colors, in blue and red. Uh, they will release a new color for the M5 E39 and also for the Volvo 815 T5 uh, R tribute. New colors for the ABT RS6R as well. We have the Misano Red and the Miami Blue. We have um, a new color for the uh, Peugeot 205 uh, Rally, also for the Nissan uh, Liberty Walk. We have it in yellow this year. Two new colors for the Audi uh, Avant S2 in uh, red, ruby red. And uh, in blue, these, are, these two are new models. A new color for the this Liberty Walk GTR as well. And also for the Golf Rally from 1989. New colors for um, the Mercedes 63 MG Black Series and the Citroën CX GTI. We have a new color for the Golf uh, 8R and also we have the, for Alpina E30 B6 uh, in this red. I'm looking for, for this model as well. We have new colors for the 75 LT. The red one and the blue, both colors look pretty good. A new color for the Peugeot 106 Rally from 2001. A new mold uh, for the Volkswagen Caddy. And it'll, it will come in two colors, in uh, um, white and blue. A new color for the Yesco uh, as well, can you say Yesco in orange. A uh, new color for the BMW M5 F19 competition. Uh, we have it in uh, blue and uh, silver as well. A new color for the Porsche 964 RS Club Sport. This mint green looks pretty nice. Again, a very nice model to have for a 143 scale collector. The Alfa Romeo Giulia Quattrofoglio uh, in green. An interesting color. I'm really a fan of the red one, but uh, that one, uh, I don't think it looks that good in uh, green. Uh, new color also for the Golf 4 R32. Also, we'll have the um, Supra in silver uh, at the 143 scale. Next, we have some new molds. We have the Aston Martin V12 in three colors. We have the green, we have the gray, and also we have the blue with uh, green accents. A new mold for the Honda Civic Type R Racing. And, uh, and we have it in two colors, in white and blue. Uh, we'll have a Hyundai E30N performance in blue and also in black. Those two are new molds as well. Uh, Next, we have new molds. There's, uh, I think, in uh, um, still in works. We have the Fiat 69 uh, Abarth Tributo. Also, we have a cool combi, uh, another Fiat uh, 695 Abarth, a BMW 1602, and a uh, TSR. Uh, Again, these are not final products, and they don't have uh, pictures. And a new interesting. Uh, Thing for us from Solido, they will make kits. So we have a Peugeot 306 Maxi kit, and uh, also we have a BMW A30 uh, brain testing. They'll uh, they'll be I think very simple. I think six pieces or something like that. And that's about it. Tell me in the comments what do you think about the new releases. I think they will release some other models. Uh, 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 as the year progresses, uh, but uh, they, these are the one they intend to bring us uh, the most, I think, uh, for now. 
And also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more videos.